Alrighty guys, today for our reading practice, you're gonna need your blue reading folder. This was in your new supply baggie, okay? So find your blue reading folder, and then we're gonna turn to page two. Page two in your folder. It has two little boys, Tim and Ted. Tim and Ted. And that's what our reading is about today. We're gonna read about Tim and Ted. There are a couple of words that we need to know before we start reading, okay? These are some heart words. They have tricky parts and they don't necessarily follow all of our reading rules. So let's read them together. They, I hear an A sound at the end. The A. They have play. I hear that A sound again. So it seems to me like the E and the Y and the A and the Y make the A sound, like the long A sound that we practiced last week. They have play out. Remember the O and the U, when they're together, they sound like ow, ow, out. They have play out. And you'll notice in your reading, those words have a slightly different color, okay? So I see they, I see out, I see play. Okay, we're going to read this together. So I want you to follow along with your finger on your paper, okay? We're going to start with the title. The title says Tim and Ted. Tim is 10 and Ted is 6. Tim and Ted like to have fun. They like to run, jog, and hop. Out in the sun, they play tag in the mud. Ted will not quit. That Q and the U sounds like qu, qu, it. You see, if I cover that, it says it. If I add the sound, qu, it says qu, it, quit. But Tim will let Ted win. Tim and Ted play with the big dog a lot. They play tug with the dog. They sit on the rug and play fit the hat on the dog. With the hat on, the dog will hop up to run. The dog is not mad. The dog will run to his bed to nap. Tim will hug the dog and Ted will pet the dog. Tim and Ted like to play and have fun. All right, guys. So in this whole thing, there are 115 words. What you're going to do right now is similar to what we did last week. <clears throat> okay, similar to what we did last week, I'm going to set the timer for one minute, one minute, and I want you to read for one minute, okay? You're going to start right here, and you're going to see how many words you can read in one minute. So when you are done... When you're done, when you hear that timer go off, you're gonna stop and you're gonna put a little line where you finish. So for example, if I ended right here and the timer went off, I'm gonna put a line to mark that that's where I stopped. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready? You've got this. Okay, remember I want you to focus on reading the words right. Ready, let's start, go.
stop. Mark where you left. Good job. Okay. Now, if you made it all the way to the end, good job. You guys are going to go through and you're going to mark the words that you felt were the trickiest in this reading. So which one were words that were the hardest in this reading, that were the hardest to read? And if you didn't make it all the way to the end, then I'm going to need you to set your own timer for one minute and you're going to have to read this again. Okay? Even if you made it to the end, I want you to practice reading this at least one more time to yourself. Okay, so maybe you can find a brother, or sister, or mom, or dad, and you can take this and you can read this to them. Alrighty.